Welcome to a new way of gardening, a way that is both sustainable and perfect for small spaces. Welcome to the world of permaculture gardening. This gardening philosophy is not just about growing plants, but it's a complete approach to sustainable living. It's about creating a self-sustaining ecosystem that mimics nature itself. Just imagine, even the smallest of spaces can be transformed into a flourishing garden, bursting with fruits, vegetables, and pollinator-attracting flowers. Good soil health is maintained through composting and mulching, while the environment is kept wildlife-friendly. It's an approach that cares for the earth, cares for people, and promotes fair sharing, all wrapped up in your own backyard. So, are you ready to break free from traditional gardening constraints and explore a method that's as rewarding to the earth as it is to us humans? Intrigued? Stick around as we delve deeper into this fascinating gardening approach. Permaculture gardening is not just a method, it's a philosophy, guided by three core principles. Let's delve into these principles and see how they form the backbone of this sustainable approach. First up, care for Earth. This principle is all about respecting and nurturing our planet. Imagine a gardener who plants a variety of fruits, vegetables, and pollinator-attracting flowers. Not only do they beautify the garden, but they also create a diverse ecosystem that supports various insects, birds, and other creatures. It's like hosting a grand feast where everyone's invited right in your backyard. Next, we have care for people. This principle is about building communities and supporting each other. Let's take the example of a neighborhood where everyone shares their surplus crops. Isn't it wonderful to imagine a community where you can enjoy your neighbor's juicy tomatoes while they savor your crunchy cucumbers? Finally, we come to the fair share principle. This principle encourages us to take only what we need and return the surplus back to the earth and the community. Think about composting your kitchen waste. You're not just reducing the trash you produce, but you're also creating nutrient-rich compost that feeds your garden and helps it thrive. These principles serve as the foundation of this gardening method. Let's explore how to apply these principles in your own small space. Permaculture is like a jigsaw puzzle, made up of many different elements. Let's piece them together. Imagine your garden as a colorful mosaic of fruits, vegetables, and pollinator-attracting flowers. Sounds enchanting, doesn't it? That's the beauty of permaculture gardening. Each plant plays its part, like actors on a stage. The fruits and vegetables nourish us while the flowers attract pollinators, creating a harmonious symphony of nature. Now, think about the soil. It's not just dirt, but a living, breathing entity. It's like the bedrock of a good permaculture garden. And how do we keep this soil healthy? Through composting and mulching, of course. Picture yourself as a five-star chef, preparing a gourmet meal for your soil. Composting is like cooking up a nutrient-rich soup, while mulching is the perfect garnish that also helps retain moisture. But wait, there's more. You see, a permaculture garden is not just for us humans. It's a haven for wildlife, too. Picture a hummingbird flitting among the flowers, or a butterfly resting on a leaf. These little critters are not just beautiful to watch, but they also play a crucial role in maintaining the balance of our garden ecosystem. So, you might be wondering why all these elements? Well, just like in a good recipe, each ingredient adds its unique flavor. The variety of plants provides a rich diversity of nutrients. The compost and mulch nourish the soil. The wildlife helps with pollination and pest control. Each element supports the other, creating a self-sustaining cycle. And the best part? You don't need an enormous space to create this magical garden. Even a small patch can become a thriving permaculture garden. It's like turning a blank canvas into a masterpiece of nature, one plant at a time. These elements, when combined, create a self-sustaining ecosystem right in your backyard. But how do we put these elements together? A good gardener knows his techniques. Let's equip you with some of the best permaculture gardening techniques. First on our list is keyhole gardening. Picture this. A garden designed like a keyhole where everything you need is within arm's reach. It's not just about convenience but efficiency too. By planting densely, you're mimicking a natural ecosystem where plants support each other. And the best part? Your garden can thrive with minimal watering and maintenance. Now that's what I call a win-win situation. Moving on, let's dig into Hugel Coulter gardening. I know, it's quite a mouthful but hear me out. This technique is all about making the most of your garden waste. By burying logs and branches under a mound of soil, you create a self-fertilizing garden bed. As the wood decomposes it releases nutrients into the soil. So while you're sipping your morning coffee, your garden is busy feeding itself. Isn't that something? Now you might be wondering, how can these techniques work in a small space? Well that's the beauty of permaculture. It's not about the size of your garden, but how you use it. 
with a bit of imagination and a dash of creativity, you can transform any space into a thriving ecosystem. And let's not forget the importance of humor in gardening. Ever heard of the tomato plant that refused to grow? It couldn't catch up? Yes, gardening puns are a thing, and they're a great way to keep things light and fun. To wrap things up, remember that the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step, or in our case, a single seed. By adopting these techniques, you're not just growing a garden but nurturing a sustainable lifestyle. With these techniques, you're ready to start your own permaculture garden, but remember, small actions can make a big difference. So, ready to transform your small space into a self-sustaining, eco-friendly garden? We've covered some great ground today, unraveling the mysteries of permaculture gardening. Remember, it's all about caring for the earth and people, and taking only a fair share. We've learned that variety is the spice of life, especially when it comes to planting fruits, vegetables, and pollinator-attracting flowers. We've discovered the importance of maintaining good soil health through composting and mulching, and creating a wildlife-friendly environment. And let's not forget the innovative techniques we've explored such as keyhole gardening and hugel culture gardening. Small actions indeed can make a big difference in following the permaculture ethics. So why not give it a try? Start small perhaps with a keyhole garden or a mini hugel culter bed. Share your experiences and let's learn together. Did you love this video? Don't forget to share it with fellow garden enthusiasts and subscribe to our channel for more such exciting content. Happy gardening!